All right, you got the water bottle? Got the water bottle. We're going to make this float. So let's do, yeah, let's do, okay, let's do a couple of practice runs here. So I'm just going to pull up a little bit, and then I'm going to push. <laughs> I guess it's yours now. I got it. There it, there it goes. Got it? <laughs> Got it? Yeah. <laughs> Did you want to try some of those inverted stalls you were talking about? Nope. Oh, okay. All right, so when you last saw me and Spencer, we'd just taken off from St. Augustine Airport and started to do some uh, aerobatics. And uh, the last thing you saw was us doing an aileron roll. And then, of course, Spencer showing off the roll rate of the extra 300. So I'm going to pull out, stop, full aileron. Holy sh <laughs> Oh, did I do two? <laughs> wow. Now we're going to take a look at some of the more intense and advanced aerobatics that we did that day. Uh, starting with the loop, it's fairly simple. Um, I don't like G's in an airplane, so it's a little bit uncomfortable. Um, you got to do this, what he calls the hook maneuver, uh, anytime you're about to uh, approach the loop or in the loop because the, the G forces uh, rush the blood. I don't know what the blood does, but you just watch the loop. You want to, want me to want me teach you a loop? I want you to do a loop and then ask me if you want to teach me a loop. Okay, so let me take the airplane. You've got the airplane. All right, so first I'm going to level this out, pick up a little airspeed, all right? So just stay on the controls with me. Okay, so as I start to pull, I come in with the right rudder, right? Because it's sure. low airspeed, high power. Yeah. And look, okay, ready? I'm right, ready. Okay, we say the hook, we look left. Hook, look left. I'm pulling, I'm adding a little bit of right rudder. Why do we look left? So we can see the wing, it's pretty. Oh. I'll look over the nose. Now I'm going to relax the stick a little bit and let it float here a moment. And let the nose drop. And once it's there, I just pull back. I go, hook. A little bit of right rudder. There we go. Keep it straight. Okay. No, I don't want you to teach me that. Okay. <laughs> All right, one of the things I really wanted to try and uh, one single time only was a snap roll. Never done a snap roll before. I was told they were pretty violent. They're pretty violent. Uh, so here's the snap roll. We're going to look at it from a couple of angles. All right, so a snap roll is where we aggressively stall the airplane. Okay. And then I pop in the rudder. So what am I going to feel? Um, a lot of weird shit. Okay. And let's, let's don't surprise Brian by doing two back-to-back -back or anything. No, I'll like, just okay. do one. <laughs> All right, ready? I believe so. I, I, there's not much I can tell you about this except um, enjoy. Okay. Hey, ready? Holy f All right. <laughs> Are you doing okay? Never do that again. <laughs> <laughs> that was an accelerated stall, and I tried to stop it on one. I stopped a little early, actually. Okay, so things I'm not expecting are the sounds I'm hearing. Like, I can definitely hear the wind hit, hit, hitting the surfaces and stuff. Yeah. Um, that's the aggressive, that's the wind aggressively departing the wing. Right, and I'm not used to, you know, all I ever hear is my engine, but through all these maneuvers, I'm hearing your engine's changing sound. Yeah. Um, the plane's making sounds. Um, okay, that's interesting. The next maneuver is the barrel roll, which is a very benign aerobatic maneuver. This is the one where you've probably seen the video of Bob Hoover pouring tea inverted. Um, if your eyes were closed, you probably wouldn't even know you were rolling. It's a lot of fun, and it's not very stressful. All right, so let's do a barrel roll, something okay. really, really benign. This is, it's a combination of a loop and a roll. Let me get a little airspeed so I can make it comfortable for you. Yeah. This isn't what you expected, is it? No. It's funny, though. I mean, you're right. You're like, you're not going to want to be up there for two hours. I'm like... I want to be up there all day. Okay, so barrel. So just relax, enjoy the maneuver. That's very pleasant. Isn't that nice? So my preference is definitely the maneuvers that are more graceful. <laughs> like, so let's do I, another barrel. Roll. I like that better than the aileron roll, even. So while we're talking, we'll do another. Okay, so this is a little bit more. Okay. It's funny, normally I don't like the way the G's feel, but. Man, that doesn't bother me at all. 
So going into this video, we had planned on making a whole nother video where I tried doing the aerobatics myself and Spencer grades me. Um, but once I got up there, I wasn't really comfortable enough. I just kind of wanted to fly. But this is the one, uh, the aileron roll was the one maneuver I did do. Okay, you got the airplane? All right. All right, I'm on it with you. Okay, you're at level flight, right? I'm at level flight. Okay, okay, here's what you do. You pull the nose up. Okay. Stop and just give it a little push on the stick. Notice there's no rudder. None at all. And when we're back to upright, just stop it. Okay, so I'm going to pull up, pull up, stop, stop, and roll. There you go. Just let the nose do its thing. Look at that. My hands, I've got my hands up so all the cameras can see my hands are up while you're doing it. All right, I'm going to do another one. i do one to the right. Okay, so do the same thing. I'm going to put yeah. my feet on the horizon. Hold on. It's, wobble, it's wiggly. All right, feet on the horizon, up, yeah. stop, and roll right. Yeah. Look at that. That one felt a little different. It's a little weird. See what I mean about the arm geometry thing? Yeah. Do another one to the right. All right, so I'm going up. My feet are on the horizon. I'm stopping, and I'm rolling. And you can use two hands on the stick if you want. Uh, no, I got a pretty good death grip on this bar over here. I'm happy with that. <laughs> All right, the half cubinate. That's another fairly benign maneuver. It's got a little bit of the G's that the loop has. Um, and other than that, it's kind of a roll. So it's, uh, I don't know, slightly a little more intense than, than just a loop, but uh, not bad at all. How about a, let's do a half cuban, which is like a loop, except we stop on an inverted 45 and then roll upright. Okay. It's, just, it's pretty gentle. I all right, you got the airplane. I promise. I got the plane. All right, ready? I'm ready. Same thing. Say hook, hook, hook left. Hook. <laughs> Look at that. Now look over the nose. Now, this time, I'm going to stop on a 45 down. Boom. One, two, three, pull. <sighs> One, two, pull. Back to level flight. Okay. That's a half cubit eight. Okay. You good? I'm good. I've learned in the last uh, 35 minutes, I really don't like being inverted. All right, Emmelman, one of my favorite maneuvers. I used to uh, fly radio-controlled airplanes, and I just love doing Emmelmans and then split S's and coming back out of it the opposite direction, and that's kind of what we did here, starting with an Emmelman and then going back down using a split S. You want to try an Emmelman? That's a half loop up and a half roll. It's pretty gentle. Okay. All right, you ready? Yeah. We get a bunch of speed. Okay, same deal. I'll put the power back in, and we're on the acro tank. All right. Put, look left. Say hook. Hook. Now look over the nose. As the nose comes around, I'm just going to roll. Oh, that's cool, man. That's an moment. That's really cool. Now a split S is the opposite. Yep. You ready for that? I am. Let's say hook. Hook. <laughs> there you go. Wasn't that nice? <laughs> Oh, this is so outside of my... Your thing? So uh -oh. did you want to try one of those, like, seven HG pulls? No. Oh, you're, are I, you over that? I'm over that. It's, there's so much that I'm now over now that I'm in the plane. <laughs> The hammerhead. Uh, I always refer to it as a hammerhead stall. Um, I learned uh, on this flight it wasn't a stall at all. It's actually not a stall. I'd always sort of envision the plane stalling and then kicking the rudder over. It's actually kind of more of just a turn uh, this direction. Very, very fun maneuver. And then Spencer, of course, unexpectedly throws in a couple of rolls at the end. You ready? I am. All right, look left. We go up. And we kick. Now look over the nose. Now I can pull the power and we can get a few rolls on the way down. <laughs> <laughs> and an easy pull. <laughs> oh my gosh. You doing good there? I'm doing good. Well, I guess this is the moment everyone's uh, probably been waiting for. You're not going to fly with Spencer Suderman and not do inverted flat spins. He does hold the world record uh, for 98 inverted flat spins. Um, I've seen the video of him doing it, and I thought, man, that doesn't look fun. And then we we did it, and it's not. I, we we did we we did a thousand feet of spins. It was it was um, it was pretty terrible. So uh, 
I, we did have the 360 camera rolling in the plane, so uh, we'll watch this from a couple different angles. It was uh, it's extremely violent. All right, do we want to like go up and knock out this inverted flat spin before you're like begging to go back? No, I'm, not, a... I'm not flying with you and not doing it, so so let's climb up. All right, are you uh, ready? I am. You okay? I don't like this at all. Ah, uh, it's gonna be great. Can we go I... back the other way? Oh, what? No. A... Ah, power's out. I'm slowing down. Oh, Go, shit. Going into an inverted um, stall. There it is. Look at that. Power's in. Right rudder. Stick forward in the corner. We are inverted flat spinning, my friend. I'm, I'm really unhappy. Power's off, opposite rudder, stick back, and we're out. There it is. Wasn't that great? What a violent experience. You want to fly the airplane for a moment? No, I want to I want to chill for a second. All right, that's cool. Oh. Get some air on your face. Dude, this is like I'm not nauseous or anything and I'm I'm just uh That was a That's an inverted flat spin, dude. You did it. It's significantly less graceful than I imagined. Like I'm the the, the being suspended from my waist, I didn't realize my, my seatbelt's certainly not as tight as I thought it was. <laughs> um, that's, what, that's what the ratchet's for. And I, I mean, I felt like I was ratcheting down as much as I could, but I'm, I'm, you're hanging. Like, I don't, know how you, I don't know how you fly the plane while you're hanging. Like, I'm sitting here holding on to these metal bars trying to, you know, I, I know I'm not going to fall out. Yeah. Um, now, the canopy won't stop you. If the seatbelt breaks, you're going to go right through the plastic. Yeah, and then I get to do an inverted flat skydive. Yeah. Remember, you pull the ring. Look, look at it. Both hands pull it. All right, you did the inverted flat spin, Brian. You're, you should be proud of yourself. I. <laughs> you want to do it again? No, I do not actually. <laughs> I'm, I'm not really glad I did it. That was a cool thing, and I have so much more respect for you doing that 90 times. Um, 98, but who's counting? Oh, Guinness was. <laughs> yeah. See how cautious I am now. Like, yeah, you're... I'm like, I want to snap roll in, woman loop, whatever. Now I'm just kind of like, I want to see a landing. Yeah. <laughs> All right, everybody, thanks for watching the video. You've now seen the most terrifying day of my life, I think. Um, if you happen to be in St. Augustine, Florida, look up Patty Wagstaff's flight school. Uh, maybe get a chance to fly with Spencer, but they do upset recovery training. They do spin training. They do aerobatic training. They do everything sort of in this genre of aviation, but uh, had a lot of fun. I don't want to do it again anytime soon. Um, we do have talk of Spencer coming out to my area and me showing how we can fly straight and level <laughs> in my airplanes. Uh, hopefully that video will get made soon. Uh, other than that, thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing, sharing, and liking. You guys have a great day. Look at that, Brian. You survived. Oh, my God. Never would have imagined a million years, like, doing that. Like, I, I literally feel like I just ran however far people can run. Like, I'm <laughs> so exhausted. Dude, you lived through it. I did. My stomach hurts. My head hurts. My back hurts. <laughs> Does it burn when you pee? <laughs> yeah, it's supposed to, I think. That was a lot of fun. I sent a picture of me getting in the plane to my friend because I wish you had something in, in your will that I wanted. <laughs> Ready? Oh, we're doing the spin on the ground. <laughs> I like that spin. There's like a lot of spins. Beep. All right. Uh. <laughs> Click this link to see the most recent video upload. Click this link to see a video that YouTube thinks you might like. Click this link to subscribe to my channel.